All right, talking with Coach Abby Llewellyn with the Chelan Goats and Coach. You know, I talked to Abby and I go, this can never get old. No, absolutely not. It's, and it's, it's different this year because we are so young and they've gotten so much better this year. So I, I'm just so incredibly proud of them and from where we started to where we ended, it's, it's been pretty cool. It's pretty fun. Job, you, you know, uh, with the, the history that is of Chelan volleyball, it's not unlike other you know, sport other other schools and sports that have these, this long heralded history, yeah. uh, and so does that bring not only extra enthusiasm, but does it also bring some extra pressure? Oh, big time, huge, huge pressure, and we talk a lot about that as a team, where we talk about you know how do we manage this and how do we handle the pressure and how do we believe that even if we fail, it's okay because we don't have to be perfect, even though we feel like the people before us have. And so it's been a huge growing curve, I mean, especially for those young ones who haven't ever experienced something like this. Um, I, again, I'm just incredibly proud of the work that they've gone through and the mental toughness that they have shown, especially um, at the end, because it's hard. It's hard to carry that, and they carried it all year, and, and they did such a good job of it. So. I thought a real key shot there. I was standing down here, and Lydia, I think it was the 23rd point, where... Freeman and they gave you all they wanted they as, as a six seed. They they did yes, pretty darn well absolutely. there. Yep. And, and but that 23rd point just seemed to really say, all right. Yep. It felt like okay, we're okay with yep. that shot. What you see because that you could just see it coming, right? Yeah, and you know that's what makes I think our kids have a little bit of edge because they play so much beach, so they're okay with being shoddy and picking teams apart a little bit. And they don't just have a hard swing with it. They have lots of Last thing, this is, I don't know, seventh or eighth state title in the school history, something like that. Fifth. fifth. Okay, yeah. fifth, fifth. How does it feel knowing that Manson got the big trophy yes oh. or two nights ago and on top of it, it's their first state championship in any sport ever? Absolutely. Boy, there's going to be partying at the, oh, at the yeah. lake oh, here. Yeah. This, uh, and these kids play a lot of clubs together, so they know each other. They're really good friends with each other. Um, we're just excited for them as well. Um, that was a long time coming for them and so you know for us to be able to celebrate together we're, we're really looking forward to that especially as a community. Well yeah there should be a big yeah. uh, a, a big to do a combined one or something there. Yeah they deserve it for sure. All right well congratulations and uh, you know we'll see you again next year. I'd be shocked if we don't. That's the goal. Thank you.